Good morning, boys, and welcome to a day in the life on a cut. Today is a very good day because this morning we woke up, we had a little haircut, just went for a walk, and I'm actually near my old house. I want to show you guys my old house, all right? So come have a look at this. The house that I grew up in, look! Oh my god! There used to be all conifer trees going along this. Like, you see behind this wall, there used to be massive trees up to like here where my finger is, and the house used to be completely covered. It was almost like we had like a kind of uh, like a fortress. We were like protecting the house. Oh man, that's weird to see them all gone. House looks like a bit of a shithole since we left. But check this out, boys. Cut progress is going fucking crazy. We started on 83.4 kg, second day 83, then 82.9, 82.2, 82.05, 81.55, and then this morning we are weighing in at 81.25 kg. Calories are still at 2,000 every single day. Steps are at 10,000 a day, and I've been doing 50 minutes cardio after workouts and on a rest day, which was yesterday. I did 30 minutes cardio, which is probably why my weight is quite a bit lower today than usual. So anyway, the cut progress has been going absolutely phenomenal, boys. I literally, I've already done like, I don't know how many steps. Let's see how many steps I've done today. Uh, 4,005, no, fucking 4,859 steps this morning, which is pretty bad, boy. But I did have a slight cheat this morning. Well, not really a cheat. I just had a coffee that was 129 calories, I believe it was. It's the oat shaken toasted vanilla espresso from Starbucks. It just tastes absolutely insane. And for 120 calories, the taste is tasting like it's like four or 500 calories. It tastes absolutely ridiculous. So the oat toasted vanilla shaken espresso, I don't know, something like that. Don't tell me I didn't put you on boys. I promise you, you have that. I believe they have like a brown sugar one. They also have like, a, I don't know what one it is, but they've got loads of different flavors and they taste absolutely ridiculous. I've got the bin men coming around me right now. And I feel like they want to go right here. I oh, know it's the line painting lads. They're checking me out. Check out the vlogs boys. Code Jade Ever Fit. No, Code Joel actually on Gymshark. Code Jade Ever Fit on my protein. Anyway, today we've got push and I'm really looking forward to push because we're going to be going to a gym that I've only been to once on YouTube. The last time I went to that gym is when I trained with Tristan Barnes. It was the Natty versus Unnatty video. If you remember that, it was a pretty sick video. I'm going to be going there with John, maybe two other people as well, Tom and Matt. You don't know Matt, but you know Tom. So, should be a pretty sick video. We're gonna go to Sainsbury's now, we're gonna pick up some food because I have absolutely no food in the house. Gonna have some breakfast and we're gonna have the pre-workout meal. Then we are gonna get going. Also, I know I have just had my hair cut, but it does look a little bit dead right now because it just always does look a little bit trash when you come out of the barbershop. You need to wait for it to marinate, you know? The marination process, if you know the marination process, you know the marination process. Let's go to the shop, let's pick up some food. Kapow. <laughs> All right, boys, little tip for you, right? If you are cutting, which I'm gonna assume the majority of you are, park as far away from the shop as possible. You can't actually see where the shop is, but I'm pretty fucking far away because you're gonna get in some extra steps, all right? I know it might be a little bit of a pain in the ass. If it is absolutely torrential rain, then yeah, you can park closer. But apart from that, boys, just literally just do it. I promise you're gonna get some extra steps in and extra steps never hurt. I promise you, steps are your best friend. Do not be missing out on the steps. Because I probably like so many people think you've got to do like hours and hours of cardio, mate. If you just get ten thousand steps in a day, that is the equivalent of probably I don't know 30, 40 minutes on the treadmill. So just do it, lad. Just do your steps, mate. I promise you, ten k steps a day, you get shredded, right? I'm going to the shop. Show you what I get after. Peace. Ah, right, boys, just got back in from the shop now. It's only a few things, but this is pretty much everything that I eat in a day. I'm a little bit weird when I do my food shops. I kind of like just do them daily, which is literally the most unoptimal thing of all time. But anyway, this is what we got. We've got some frozen blueberries. We've got some eggs. Pretty simple, lad. We've got some beef mints. We've got some skier yogurt. Now, I've been seeing this Welsh guy on my TikTok. Can't remember his name. He's a beast. He's a hybrid guy. And basically, I always have the Farge. Oh my God. Did you said this in the last video? The Farge, the Phage. Please, does someone tell me how to pronounce it? I know someone told me. I think it's Fahag. Fah. Oh, for fuck's sake. I'm not even going to say it. But anyway, that is £5.50. This has literally the same macros, right? 0% fat free. This was £1.25. And you get the same amount of yogurt. 
So actually, no, you don't get the same amount of yogurt. You don't get the same amount of yogurt. You do actually get about half, but still, one pound twenty-five. So it's actually two pound fifty instead of five pound fifty for the same amount. So this is pretty sick. This has got uh, per one hundred grams sixty calories, ten grams of protein. That is pretty optimal. I've also got some salmon. Obviously, that's pretty expensive, uh, but that's kind of the only real expensive thing I've got in here. Then I've got this rice, which is probably not the most optimal rice as well, but it's really easy to cook. You boys, if you know about the VT rice, you know about the VT rice. So, yeah. This is everything we got. I think this cost me like £10, no, like £11. I don't know. I'm not actually, I can't remember, to be honest. Anyway, I'm going to get home, going to cook it up, then we're going to have the pre workout meal, then we're going to go train. I'm hype. I can't wait to go to this gym, it's so sick. Boys, we are back home and we have breakfast. Obviously, you know what it is. It's the two eggs, the salmon. Now, this is poached eggs, but check this out, right, boys? So, I'm actually doing the poached eggs the way my mum does them, right? So, instead of using like a real big, like, pot like this, this bad boy right here, yeah? Look at that, it's got some girth on it. My mum, she uses a little one like this, and they come out more like fried poached eggs, like this. And, I don't know, I think they're pretty nice, um, yeah. So yeah, this is my breakfast. Very, very tasty. Now, I am currently listening to the Modern Wisdom podcast. The episode that I'm listening to is the one with Healthy Gamer, Dr. K. All right, I've literally just started listening to it. I'm four minutes in. Um, it's a fucking banger so far. I'm absolutely loving this. Now, when I'm cutting, I always feel like I just become so much more productive in every single thing I do. Like, the content that I consume is more healthier for my brain. I, you know, I walk more, I go outside more, I socialize more, apart from when you get really deep into the gut. Just, I don't know, everything just seems to go really well in my life when I'm cutting. I have so much structure. Everything is just amazing. I, I don't know what it is. Um, but yeah, cutting is just good for me. I don't know why. I just function better with it. Um, also, one more thing. We have got a little bit extra toast than usual because we're doing a slight refeed today because we've been losing weight extremely fast and I'm gonna give myself a slight refeed for today's push session. Hopefully have a fucking awesome session. Um, so yeah, that's a little update for you boys. Gonna eat this, then we got one more meal, then we got push. So see you at the pre-workout, peace. Rizmeister 247. Every day I'm shuffling. It's decent. It's decent. It's decent. What are we doing right now? Ah, uh, boys, we're literally just sat in the car right now. What's the settings looking like, by the way? Oh, it looks epic. Okay. Why does Blood not trust me on the camera? I'm sorry. All right, boys, we're in the car right now. We are on the way to Progress Gym in Yeovil. I've been there before. I said this earlier, but if anyone's going to be there today, you're going to be in the vlog, mate, because last time there was quite a few people who came up. So if you boys are there again, I was telling you I'm going to be there again. So it is currently 2 o'clock. It's going to take us about 30 minutes to get there. Oh, it's the Easter holidays, bro. There probably oh, yeah. will be people there, so, man. Um, yeah, we're going to Progress Gym. Push day. Just waiting for JP outside of his house. Oh, classic. Uh, I'm excited. I'm excited. We're going to get some tunes on. Let's get down. Push day. Inside. What the fuck are you laughing at? Get some bro? tunes on, lad. Come on. We're going to get some tunes on. Look at this fucking guy, by the way. He thinks he's funny, but this guy is literally just... Destroyed his car. Yeah, I literally just destroyed it, bro. Oh, boy, he's, you can't even. He's trying to. He's trying to be happy through the pain. Yeah, right. Now. right. You know, he's like literally just. You know, like when you go into the gym, yeah. Every penny. You know, like when yeah. you go to the gym, right? And you've just like you're in year eleven, you just broke up with your girlfriend, and it's that sort of pain. That's what I'm feeling right now. But with my yeah, car, that wasn't funny. No, no. It wasn't meant to be funny. Yeah, yeah, this guy. But anyway, boys, you're cutting as well right now, aren't you? Yeah, I am. I've What's actually, your weight? Sir? I've lost three kilos, bro. What did you start at? Uh, eighty-one. Wait, you've lost three kilos since when? Since like. Three and a half weeks ago. Oh, nice. Pretty optimal rate, rate mate. So eighty-one. I was eighty-one. Now I'm sitting at seventy-eight point two. I'm eighty-one right now. Wow. Eighty-one and a half. All right, let's get some tunes on, man. Baby, we're, we're gonna play some. Like nah, shine. Maybe some NCS or maybe some Tevers. What the fuck is he doing? All right, Baby Led Johnson. <laughs> That was a lock that takes the absolute Michael. He's li he's lost his head. He's lost his head. He's not coming out. Yo, not what is he doing? I, think I literally told him I was coming to his house after getting you. Right, see you later, boys. See you when the music's on. What did, John what did, what did he say? He said he just texted me. Oh, what? Are you okay in the brain? Also, my background is the word yes. Say more yes. Say yes to more things. <laughs> Progress.
Oh uh, boy, session finished. We just did some posing here. We did it for TikTok and Instagram. And look at this, by the way. It's like a strongman area with loads of bin bags. Session was <laughs> 10 though. Actually had a good session. Wait, these are bin bags, aren't they? Yeah, I know. just had a run. I got balls. You got nice big balls. All right, anyway, see you at home for the post workout meal. Got a long drive. Well, not long drive, but like, got to drop Tom out. So I'll probably be like home in like 45 hour. Boys, this is how dedicated we are to the cart right now, right? We've realized we didn't do our cardio at the last gym, so we pulled up to the actual gym and we're doing Wait, the cardio. Wait, how many kilos are you down? Or you're not pounds down, whatever. No, I'm down, down like two, nearly two kilos in a week. Nice. What the hell? Let's do the cardio. And it's the end of the day, so I'm gonna game. You know what I've been playing right now? You're probably not gonna be able to guess, but if you're a gamer, then you might be able to guess. I know this is gonna be quite niche, and some of you, obviously, you're gonna know what game it is. But the game I've been playing is... DESTINY 2! DESTINY 2! Something that you boys won't probably know about me. Well, super OGs might know about me, but um, bro, I used to be an absolute addict to Destiny. And the last expansion has just come out, so... Um, I want to play it. Well, it's coming out in June. And I've just been playing a massive PvP player. I love PvP. I'm not going to waffle too much about Destiny, but if you play Destiny, put it in the comments down below because uh, personally, I think it's a fucking sick game. But I have got a few too many hours on it. Obviously, it has been like a very long lifespan now, but I think like Destiny 1 and 2 included, I've had like 3,000 hours, which is a lot of fucking hours. <laughs> but I, I, it's just been one of my childhood games. I've played it for like the last 10 years, well, on and off. But anyway, enough talk about that. Um, yeah, boys. Thank you for watching this video. I love you all. Peace out, like and subscribe, and um, yeah, love you all boys, peace.